So the drills are a way to ensure military readiness against North Korea, but the diplomacy angle continues on the other side of the world. The foreign ministers of South Korea and France met in Paris on Monday to discuss how best to counter Pyongyang's nuclear and missile threats. Kim mok reports. During talks in Paris on Monday, South Korean Foreign Minister Kang kyung hwa and her French counterpart Jean-Yves Le Drian agreed on implementing strong sanctions on North Korea, which they say will eventually lead the reclusive regime to the negotiating table. Speaking to reporters after the talks, the two officials said that North Korea's nuclear activities pose a serious threat to the security of the international community, adding that all options should be employed to solve the issue. The ability of North Korea to obtain a nuclear weapon and especially to achieve the necessary miniaturization to enable it to be carried by a ballistic missile is a serious breach of the non-proliferation treaty and a serious threat to the security of the world. The nuclear threat from North Korea is at a very serious state. North Korea is developing its nuclear missile capacity at a very fast pace, and as the minister has mentioned, this is not just a problem for South Korea, but also a biggest problem concerning the international community. In another meeting with the Korean press afterwards, Kang said that through her visit to Europe, she was able to confirm the international society's support for Seoul's decisive role in dealing with Pyongyang. She added that a lot could be learned from how the EU member countries were able to solve Iran's nuclear issue through dialogue. Kang also said that South Korea and France plan to hold their third strategic dialogue at a mutually convenient time in Seoul next year for further discussion and cooperation. Kim Mok-yeon, Arirang News.